Hi everybody, my name is Dane Schiller. I'm a project field intern at Battle Creek Lakeview. And today I'm gonna to be telling you a little bit about my responsibilities that I had over the summer. So to start my day off, I get in the office around 7 a.m., which shortly after I will start the daily log where I create the list of all the contractors that are gonna be on site and how many people they have and what they're gonna be doing. So once I do that, I will walk around the three stages of construction that we have, which is site work, the renovation and addition. So while I'm walking around those sites, I will talk to the contractors that are on site and make sure they are doing what they need to be doing. And if they have any questions, they can ask me. Uh, I'll answer them to my best ability. And if I can't answer them, I'll take them to my PM. And once I'm done with that, I get back to the office and tidy up the daily log if I missed anything. After I'm done with the daily log, my days vary, but some days I'll create RFIs, I'll create change events, I'll, after the change events, I'll send out the RFQs, but sometimes I also do research on scopes of work and submittals to answer any questions that any trades or anybody might have. So, but the thing I've enjoyed most is the RFIs and making sketches for the RFIs because when we create the RFIs the way we do it is we create a sketch with the blueprints that we have highlighting the area that we're talking about so when we do that it really helps me understand what's wrong with the area that we're talking about and how we might go about fixing it and so once we get the answer to that back I create the change events and send out the RFQs. So that's my typical day. Let's take a look at Lakeview. The area I just showed you guys through is Unit E, which is our renovation portion of the project. And so with it being a renovation, it's mainly just facelifts. But the main thing we did is VUVs. We replaced all the unit ventilators. Uh, we put up a few masonry walls. Uh, we then painted them and put in new flooring. So with that, let's go to Unit G. When I first started working with CSM this summer, it was pretty cool because Unit G was all dirt. So I got to see the footings and foundations being poured. I got to see the underground plumbing. And now we're building up our masonry walls to the second finished floor and we have steel starting. 
uh, electrical and plumbing rough-ins are going in. So it's, it's really cool to see it from start to finish because I've never done that with a project with CSM. So now let's take a look at site work. The site work at Lakeview includes a new student drop-off area, a teacher parking lot, and a bus loop. So I was told to give a fun fact about my site. So my fun fact is gonna be the same as last summer's, but when I went to school, I went to Lakeview. So before school got out, I got to see all the teachers that I had and all the classrooms that I sat in. And it's really cool kind of just to look back on my memories. At this time, I'd like to say thank you to everybody from CSM, but more specifically, I would like to thank the Lakeview group, which is Diane Morris, Christy Rafferty, John Bammer, and Bruce Akay. Uh, I learned so much from all of them, and I really appreciate their patience while I'm still learning a little bit about construction. So thank you everybody for watching my video, and I hope you enjoyed.